So this story comes from New York, and it's about an NYPD sergeant named Hugh Berry who faces termination and is also facing charges and is now on trial for the death of a schizophrenic woman. And this story is going to be crazy because you're going to see the lack of accountability and you're going to see just how much police officers can actually get away with and how long it takes for someone to get justice. And so more than five years ago in October of 2016, Deborah Danner was inside of her own apartment when Hugh Berry ignored all orders to stand down and did not show any aggression, just rushed into her apartment. And Deborah Danner, because she's over 60 years old, grabbed a baseball bat and she tried to defend herself because all she knows is that she has schizophrenia. She's an old woman. She lives in New York and a man just entered into her apartment even though based on police protocol, even if you do know police protocol, he wasn't supposed to actually do that. So he ran in and shot and killed this woman inside of her own home. And he was previously acquitted of criminal charges after being the first on-duty cop to face a murder rap since 1999. That shows you the problem right there. So he was acquitted of this initially, and I want you to see what happened after that. We're going to go a little bit back in time here. And so this article is from 2018 from the New York Post. A cop acquitted in Bronx woman shooting now up for promotion. This is when Sergeant Hugh Berry became Sergeant Hugh Berry. This is when he got promoted. He got promoted after killed this woman. That's what happened here. So that shows you that now that he's facing a trial, that that was the wrong decision. And that I want you to imagine what this woman's family was feeling as this man is getting promoted essentially for killing an old woman in her own home. And if you look further into that article for 2018, you will find that, that the president of the Sergeant's Benevolent Association, who was Ed Mullins, said the NYPD commissioner should accept the court's decision and take Barry off of death duty, even though he had just killed someone and now he's facing the trial. My question is, is the Sergeant's Benevolence Association, you know, the freaking police union there, are they gonna come out and modify their position based on what we are we are now seeing because that was back in 2016 2017 2018 this was pre-george floyd so all the cases were were cops were, were were considered heroes we should look back at that now because as you can see we as a country made the wrong call just like i've been saying all along